Welcome everyone. Such a joy to have you as we study on the subject of humility. We've seen that the Lord Jesus is our greatest model and example uh, when it comes to the walk of humility. We've also seen that it's so important for us to employ humility in our interactions and human relationships. Uh, how does God view our pride or our humility? So let's quickly look at a passage from 1st Peter chapter 5 um verse 5 here says likewise you younger people submit yourselves to your elders yes all of you be submissive to one another and be clothed with humility for god resists the proud but gives grace to the humble so god um is a god who doesn't like pride he wants us to clothe ourselves with humility clothing oneself with humility is an act of the will humility will not happen automatically we need to put it on we need to choose to walk in humility and we've seen how having the right perspective about our identity about who god is and who other people are will enable us to walk in such humility so uh, let's quickly look at the message version um of um you know uh, the part where it says god resists the proud but gives grace to the humble so the message version says god has had it with the proud but takes delight in just plain people so god uh, is someone who uh, abhors or he is someone who dislikes uh, pride so much he would like to associate with the humble and that's quite clear when we consider the life of jesus he was not one to um uh, to to condone the uh, the self righteousness of the pharisees or the the religious attitude of the pharisees but you know, he was the somebody who appreciated people with uh, a humble spirit you know, people with the right heart attitude people who um came to god with an attitude of worship you know, if we can recall the tax collector and the widow uh, who both brought their offerings we see jesus applauding what the widow did and um we see jesus condemning the attitude of the tax collector and that is jesus for us that is god for us who never like pride uh, but he wanted us to walk in humility so pride um has to do with arrogance haughtiness uh, it has to do with self exaltation self importance boasting self glorification um and considering oneself superior than others but no we see that humility is uh, to consider god uh, as the source of everything and to also have the right view of people that um, that you know we esteem others just as much as us or even greater than us so humility is a prerequisite for us to receive divine grace in our lives we've seen here that god gives grace to the humble uh, for us to grow we need god's grace for us to increase Uh, in the anointing of god for our lives or the skills or the purpose of god for our lives we need his grace we will never have his grace if we walk in pride grace comes only when we walk in humility so let's walk in humility let's pray together heavenly father we thank and praise you for the truth of your word lord we see your heart regarding humility enable us lord to always choose humility over pride and arrogance in Jesus name we pray amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally for more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk please visit apcwo.org